So as you can see here, the key to tying in frames is to make sure that your comb is all the way up at the top. The bottom you can have a little bit of gap, they'll seal it in. Put rubber bands around there beforehand, makes it easier for... And you put those on the outside. Try and use as Try and use the draw cone that you got in there. Use that first. When you're cutting, that's the kind of knife you want to have. You can see lobes upon lobes. <laughs> this ain't just any comb. This is a comb tied in with every little stinking <laughs> one of those. Ah. Uh. Anyways, the queen's in there somewhere. We're gonna find her. When you see her, you grab her real quick. But these are definitely your spring and summer bees. The little ones that were in here before, they're all gone. All right, hold tight. Just to make sure you can see what you're doing. Puff a little bit of smoke in there. As you can hear, they are a ginormous hive in there. Work your way slowly. It's like wiggling a loose tooth. You know it's attached to something, but as you do it, they're all inside there. And you don't want to smash any. But once you get an opening in there, you can start trimming away a whole lot easier. I haven't got it into the brood chamber yet, but I know it's going to be here shortly. Won't be long. There's a few other things I could use, like, like a warm, a towel that's been soaked in warm water so I can clean my hands off. You can just leave those, don't even, um, and I was going to have you video while you came down here, once you did. You can throw them. Can you throw them? How hard you can you throw? No, you can bring them down with a towel, a warm towel please. And you and some lingerie, maybe? Well, don't get any sexier in this, babe. Except you and lingerie. Oh, y'all were recording. Crap. 